Hello everyone. Thank you for watching our webinar about Faculty of Medicine in Košice, Slovakia. This webinar is for prospective students and applicants who are considering their studies of medicine or dentistry in Košice. Why we did this webinar? Applicants usually have plenty of questions and are not able to find answers on faculty's page or elsewhere on internet. These questions usually range from how is the entrance examination in Košice like or how do I get an accommodation to what is the quality of faculty of medicine in Košice and so on. We have decided to sum up everything relevant and created this video with headline Everything you need to know about Faculty of Medicine in Košice, Slovakia. Webinar answers the most frequent questions in very objective way. Let's start our webinar. Maybe you have never heard of Košice before. So let's tell you more about this amazing city. Where is Košice located? Košice is located in eastern Slovakia. It has its own airport with direct connection to Prague. Vienna, London, Bratislava, Kiev, Doncaster, Bristol and Milan. In addition to that, you can also use airports of big cities around. Airport of capital of Slovakia, Bratislava, airport of Budapest or Krakow. In other words, you can comfortably come to Košice by plane, by train, car or bus. Košice has really long history. First written reference came from year 1230. Statute of city was given to Košice in year 1241. Košice played important historical role practically from 17th century. It has developed to the second biggest city of Slovakia with more than 240,000 inhabitants. Thanks to the many beautiful buildings of Košice and reconstructing Main Street, Košice is referred as one of the most beautiful cities in Slovakia. You can find three universities here. Pavel Josef Šafalik University, Technical University and University of Veterinary Medicine and Pharmacy. That means that in cafeterias and pubs you can meet plenty of university students every evening. What are the prices in Košice like? Your monthly budget might be around 400 euros which covers all of your expenses. For example, beer at pub is 150, monthly ticket for public transportation for student is 10 euros, accommodation at dormitories is around 90 euros and so on. If you compare these expenses to, for example, Germany, where monthly living costs are around 800 euros, you save around 400 euros a month or 4,000 euros for 10 months during one academic year in Slovakia. Now, let's proceed to institution which covers faculty of medicine, and that is Pavel Josef Šafalik University. University was established on 28th of November 1989 and has currently more than 7,800 students. It is the second oldest university in Slovakia and successor of University of Košice, founded in 1657. You can see facade of rectorate of Pavel Josef Šafalik University on the picture. Let's move on to Faculty of Medicine itself. Interesting fact about faculty is that it is older than university itself because it was founded in 1948, 11 years before establishment of university. Since 1992, there are English study programs offered to international students, general medicine and dental medicine. Faculty runs under European credit transfer and accumulation system, which is a standard for comparing study attainment and performance of students in higher education in whole European Union and other collaborative countries. This means that transfer of completed courses from another university is possible. In other words, you are free to continue your studies here or elsewhere in Europe without problems. On the picture, Faculty of Medicine is situated on the left. Tall building next to the faculty 
is university hospital called also new hospital where students go for their practicals here are some really important information about faculty there are more than 12,000 graduates since establishment of faculty in 1948 the reason is simple degree is internationally recognized and you can work with it in european union usa and in the most countries around the world you can rely on your degree because the quality of education is ensured by meeting accreditation criteria. and last complex accreditation process conducted by Pavel Yosef Shafarik University faculty of medicine gained 3.95 points from maximum of 4 faculty gets this great rating also thanks to the close collaboration with university hospital hospital where students go for their practicals is located next to the faculty students are in direct contact with patients from the early beginnings of their studies not every patient speak english of course that is the reason why one of the subject of curriculum is Slovak language. It is not easy, but speaking at least basics of Slovak brings you much closer to your patients. Great news is that laboratories and research facilities at faculty were reconstructed from European structural funds in recent years. Let's see some pictures of them. I guess you must be really curious about specifics of study programs for international students. There are two study programs for international students, general medicine and dental medicine. General medicine is an undergraduate program taught in English language. The study of general medicine lasts for six years or 12 semesters and graduates are awarded degree doctor of general medicine. During these six years, students obtain adequate theoretical knowledge of practical, preclinical and clinical subjects. In practical training, students learn basics of preventive, diagnostic and therapeutic procedures. In comparison to Germany and other countries, there is no numerus clausus, which means limited availability of places for students, so everyone who passes an entrance examination is enrolled to faculty. Furthermore, you do not need to wait for your results. You get information whether you are accepted or not, usually within 7 to 10 working days. We will speak about entrance examination later on. There are around 200 students accepted to program general medicine each year. Fee for studying is 10,500 euros for two semesters and is paid in two installments. Dental medicine is second undergraduate study program offered for international students. It lasts for six years or 12 semesters and graduates are awarded with degree doctor of dental medicine. Stress is put on practical skills of students so they are able to perform basic stomatology procedures on their own after graduation. Compared to study program of general medicine, only 20 students are accepted each year. Fee for this study program is 11,000 and is paid in two installments. In year 2015, there were around 900 international students at Faculty of Medicine and this number is growing continually. Students come from all over the world, such as Germany, Greece, Saudi Arabia, Poland, Spain, Portugal or Italy. So you will not be definitely the only international students there. Students form groups of 10 to 15 people in which they attend seminars and practicals and are free to ask anything to teachers. As you can see, students of both general and dental medicine are in contact with patients so they can develop practical knowledge. Besides, students take part in various activities such as informing public about dental hygiene and so on. If you decide to apply for Faculty of Medicine in Košice, you must pass an entrance examination. Entrance examination is held usually in June and in August. It consists of 100 questions from biology and 100 questions from chemistry. All questions are from one databank that can be bought from university, but our agency can provide it to you free of charge. 
If you want to be sure that you are accepted, you must score at least 555 points from 800 possible in multiple choice tests. If you want to prepare, you should revise basic of chemistry and biology firstly, and then go question by question from databank. Which documents will you need if you decide to apply? Firstly, go to portal faculty and find e-application. Your application must be filled out on computer and then signed. Some fields are a little bit tricky, so do not hesitate to contact a study department or contact us. We can help you free of charge. Secondly, you must submit medical confirmation about your physical and mental ability to study. This document cannot be older than three months. Thirdly, submit scan of your passport or ID. Fourthly, you need to show that you paid 40 euros fee to university. Bank account number can be found on faculty page. Finally, submit school leaving certificate. Certificate must be certified by Slovak notary and other public institution, both in Slovakia and in your country. The procedure is really long and time consuming, so if you are not sure with this one, we recommend you to use service of our agency. Next question, which applicants ask quite a lot is, are we eligible for the same scholarship as Slovak students? And the answer is yes, you are. There are various scholarships for students based on your good study results, on great representation of faculty at conferences or sport competitions, and finally social scholarship. Concrete sums of scholarships varies from year to year, so we advise you to ask international study department. We are quickly nearing to the end of this webinar. Now, imagine this situation. You just pass entrance examination and are almost student of faculty. What you should do after coming to Košice? Firstly, enrollment to faculty is the most important, of course. During enrollment, you are about to choose your subjects for first year of your study with minimum load of 40 credits. Secondly, do not forget to pay scholarship until the end of August, otherwise you need to pay penalty for every day of delay. Thirdly, Faculty of Medicine is organizing informational day for freshers. You can get plenty of information about organization of study, faculty itself or your duties in upcoming semesters there. Fourthly, do not forget to arrange accommodation. There are guaranteed places for students of medicine at dormitories in Street Popratska, where prices start from 83 euros a month. Fifthly, every international student in Slovakia must be insured by commercial insurance. Do not forget to do this. And lastly, register at foreign police. Everyone who stays longer than three months in Slovakia must be registered at foreign police. Problem is that usual people at police do not speak English language at all. Feel free to contact us. We are there to help. Last question that will be answered in our webinar is should I appoint agency or not? Preparation for entrance examination is really time consuming and stressful. Solving various problems with your papers can make your situation even more complicated. Studying abroad can change your life completely. So why wasting your unique opportunity and time? Appoint agency and if possible hours. So what do we offer and how much do we charge? We offer following. Preparation for entrance examination. We will provide you with a database of questions for entrance examination, both for chemistry and biology. Personal assistance. We will assist you in person when you come to Košice for entrance examination and later during your studies on. Flight searching. We will help you to find a flight in Košice in case you do not want to live in dormitory anymore. Insurance arrangement. As every foreigner must be insured when living abroad, we will help you with this. Legal support and assistance. There is plenty of paperwork that must be done. 
especially regarding recognition of your school leaving document. We will help you with that. Club membership. Thanks to the membership in our club, you do not need to pay entrance fee to events we organize and you are still eligible to special offers from our partners. Bank account. Bank account is must because you will need it when you are paying rent, withdrawing money from ATM or paying for beer contactless. We will assist you with this when you go to the bank. City guide. You can feel lost in the first days after coming to Kosice. We will help you with city guide that will contain useful information, numbers and everything else you need to know about this amazing city. Assistance and foreign police. Everyone from EU who stays in Slovakia must register at foreign police. Problem is that police clerks usually do not speak English or German. We will help you step by step. How much does it cost? For the first 10 applicants, method service is completely free of charge. Only money you need to pay are for entrance examination and various legal fee related to study. That was our webinar. We hope that you enjoyed it and that all of your questions have been answered. If not, please do not hesitate to contact us at methead at methead.eu. We are happy to help you completely free of charge.